Okay. <sighs> Jurassic World opens today. Go Jurassic World, I hope it's good. I hope it's good. Cause Jurassic Park was so good. Jurassic Park is one of those movies where if you see it on TV, you're stopping. Then I got to thinking, okay, what other movies are unflippable? Here they are, the top 10 movies you cannot flip past. My neighbor. Number 10, The Bourne Identity or any of the Bourne movies. Quite honestly, I can't tell them apart. There's the one with uh, the girl from Run Lola Run. There's one with the scene in a train station. Uh, he falls in water a couple of times. They're all kind of the same. Number nine, Forrest Gump. He gets to meet presidents. He goes to war. Jenny gets AIDS. This movie has it all. Number eight, The Fugitive. I didn't kill my wife. Number seven, any Arnold Schwarzenegger movie. He's on the list for his catchphrases alone. I need your clothes, your boots, and your motorcycle. Gun the chopper is not a tumor. I'm really good at Schwarzenegger. Number six, Alien, Sigourney Weaver. Quite honestly, you only really need to see the scene where the alien pops out of her stomach and then you can move on. Pulp Fiction is so good that for me, John Travolta gets a pass no matter what he does. John Travolta could join ISIS and I'd be like, yeah, but Pulp Fiction. And who knows, maybe Scientology is the right religion. We don't know. Maybe it is. Maybe Xenu is the real deal. <laughs> Goodfellas, amazing movie. And you've really got to embrace the censorship on TV. The swearing is hilarious. You moldy fingered son of a book. Forget you, you motherfada. And now for the top three movies you can't flip past. <laughs> Number three, The Matrix. You're not flipping past The Matrix. In the 90s, this is how we imagined the internet was gonna be like. We'd be cool, we'd all wear uh, latex goth costumes and sweat our balls off dancing to Prodigy. My Hotmail had the number 69 in it. It was a different time. Number two, Shawshank Redemption. I dare you to flip past Shawshank. Your TV could be on fire and you'd still wait till the commercial. If it comes down to saving your dog or watching Shawshank on TV, sorry Fido, he just got out of jail. And the number one movie that you cannot flip past, Mean Girls. I'll say this here, Mean Girls is the funniest movie ever made. Totally underrated as far as a brilliant comedy. You got Tina Fey, you got Amy Poehler, you've got Lindsay Lohan who's so funny, you forget what she turned into. Oh, Lindsay, what happened? It has the best lines. She doesn't even go here. Boo, you whore. Stop trying to make fetch happen. It's not going to happen. There's your number one, Mean Girls. Do you agree? Do you disagree? Fight it out in the comments. And subscribe, either here or here or here, or here, or here, or here. I don't know how to get rid of these things. Monday, hey, Monday we're gonna talk about uh, Game of Thrones, the season finale, so uh, definitely tune in for that.